Hello everyone, Zunokami from Essence of Zen here. Previously, I gave my initial thoughts on a pair of wireless earbuds. Well now, I'm ready to give my review of them after over two weeks of use. So what is it that really got me to run out and order these? Well, it's rather simple, the price. I knew that for approximately $20, I wasn't going to get earphones that sounded like Sennheisers or Audio-Technica. However, I wasn't going to go out and spend $160 on fancier wireless earbuds either. I wanted to see how much bang for my buck I could get. The specs of the device kind of range from something you would see in your everyday average earbuds. It uses a CSR chipset from the UK. The Bluetooth is version 4.2, has 2.4 gigahertz for the frequency, and it basically uses Nokia charging ports for charging. This also reportedly approximately 3 hours of battery in use as well as 60 hours on standby and you can double that time if you're only using one of the earbuds. So basically, the basic normal specs if you ask me. Looking at the earbuds, I thought they were going to appear to be jutting out of my ears, but in reality they fit and look rather flush to the overall ears. Your experiences may vary because, well, your ears will vary. Uh, and more importantly, once you put on the proper silicone plugs for your ear canal sizes, they'll stay in for even the most heavy use of jamming sessions. And boy was I jamming. The sounds is your typical sound, nothing special, no emphasis on the bass, no emphasis on the treble, just your typical $20 earphone sound. But generally these earbuds, to me, are perfectly fine for music, specifically music, and I'll tell you why when it comes to the functionality. The one single glaring flaw that I experienced with these particular set of earbuds is that it has a noticeable lag, and by lag I mean a delay, about half a second if not three fourths of a second, but that delay is quite noticeable. What this means is, with the media pertaining to just audio, things like music, podcasts, sound bites, audiobooks, etc., this will work just fine. But anything with a visual medium will annoy you immensely because the video will always be half a second ahead of the audio you're listening to. Another slight issue that I've experienced from time to time is an occasional drop in one of the earbuds. It's rather annoying, but it'll come back hopefully within half a second or two. Overall, I'll be keeping these, and will likely have these as my main drivers when I'm working out or on the go. If these seems like devices you'd want, well, we'll leave a link in the description below. Remember, these are $20, they're a great competitor in terms of price to performance to the Apple AirPods, which are, again, $160. If you want to see more of the initial thoughts on these X1T wireless earbuds, you can see our previous video for my initial thoughts there. I've been Zeno coming from Essence of Zen, and I will see you all in the next review or initial thoughts or unboxings. But until then, as always, take care. March winds and April showers, break away